All right, gang. Nerd in the week here of Thursday. And this is coming from K or WKYC.com. Actor R. R. E. Lehman, who was first, who was the first guy to portray Jason Voorhees in the original Friday the TV for fans in Northeast Ohio. So we're going to go ahead and read the article here, and this is where it's coming from. You guys can really see that. Make sure it's focusing. But Arlene was a child actor when he was the first person to portray Jason Voorhees in the original film. A Hartville, Ohio, Jason Voorhees of the Friday the 13th film series is among the most notorious horror movie villains of all time, and the first actor to play the iconic role is making two stops in North East Ohio this week. Arlene, who was the child actor under the makeup during the unforgettable jump scare finale at Camp Crystal Lake in the original Friday the 13th in 1980, will appear at meet and greet events in Medina and Hartville. First up, Liam made a stop at Operation Phantom in Media on Wednesday from 5 to 7.30 p.m. Let's see. Let me read more, read more here. Liam shared the following message about his visit to North, Northeast Ohio. Liam is also uh, Liam shared the following. Liam is also part of the heavy metal band of Currently known as First Jason. So Jason Ward is that character who is best known for wearing the hockey mask went on to become the focus of multiple sequels throughout the 12 movies within the Friday 13th franchise. Don't, re- don't remember the ending of the original Friday 13th? Watch the clip below to see Liam in action. So, my thing is, I never met the guy. This is one guy I would want to meet because I, uh, you guys can see in the background, let me turn the light. You can see in the background, right, 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 right back here a little bit in the dark. Here's my Friday 13th part one poster that's signed by Deborah Ace and Adrian King. Uh, I had an opportunity to meet him at Chicago's Woods World quite a few years ago. It is now called uh, Fan Expo. Passed him up because I wanted to meet uh, Robert Kurtzman, special effects makeup artist. But uh, anyways, I'm hoping one of the Chicago conventions gets Ari Liam someday in the future because that would be definitely a huge thing. I've always wanted to meet him. Uh, I think it's really cool for the people in Ohio uh, in those two uh, parts where he was going. I thought that was really, really awesome. I know he's very, very energetic with the fans from what I've heard and, you know, what I've seen on uh, on like his interviews and stuff. He's very, very energetic, very, very, you know, uh, outgoing, it seems like. So, I've never had really a big, you know, problem with any of the Friday 13th guests that I've met, you know. Uh, the only one I didn't really have much time to talk to was C.J. Graham because there was a fan that was up there talking to him left and right and before I, meet, I got up there to meet him. But uh, it's been a positive experience meeting the Friday 13th alumni uh, so far. So our Liam is definitely, you know, one of the ones I'm really wanting to come to Chicago and, you know, meet. So what we're further to do if you're living in Ohio and you're watching this video and you went to the, you went to those uh, conventions where he was at or the meet and greets where he was at, uh, th- that is awesome. Cause I, I'm still waiting for my turn to actually meet him. And I know it's going to happen some sooner or later. But other than that, guys, this is a very simple video. Uh, I think starting this weekend, we'll continue to talk of the 1990 Stephen King It uh, miniseries. I think we're going to talk about what I like about the franchise or what I like about the film. Uh, and I can't find anything wrong with it. I mean, I know it's not by the book. I, a lot of it, uh, a lot of the book isn't in that film. And, you know, other than that, but that's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And remember, man, uh, I'm going to be going to uh, Days of Dead Chicago here in about a week and a half now. So get ready for that Friday 13th Part 3 mini reunion. And uh, if, I, if, if I can, I'm going to try to meet uh, uh, Derek. McKinnon, I think that's how you say his last name, the killer from uh, the original Terror Train 1980 that starred Jamie Lee Curtis. So take care.